Mercedes boss Toto Wolff has criticized the controversial Formula One cockpit safety device known as the Halo, believing it looks completely alien. More than eight years of dedicated research has gone into cockpit protection in single-seaters, and F1 cars will look radically different next season after the sport's governing body confirmed in July that the device is to become mandatory in 2018. The concept, however, has had its critics, with recently crowned world champion Lewis Hamilton describing the halo, first trialed in winter testing last year and designed to block flying debris, as the worst-looking modification in the sport's history. And Wolf has hit out at the much maligned concept and has suggested the sport needs to find a more elegant solution as soon as possible. Speaking to ESPN, he said, it's a dreadful piece. We've had it in this staff briefing, and we've shown it. It's a huge piece of metal, much too heavy, it feels completely alien, and I'd like to saw it off if I could. But then we need to look after driver safety, and if there is a device that helps to protect lives, then we need to put it on the car. Maybe in the future we can find a solution that is a little bit more aesthetically pleasing than the halo. In terms of aerodynamic development it didn't interfere too much, and everyone has the same problem. F1 chiefs have increased the minimum weight of the cars by 5 kilograms next year to accommodate the halo, but Wolf believes the cars could weigh double that with all the fittings. He added, with all the bolts and nuts, it's probably 10 kilos that you have up at the highest point in the car. So the center of gravity moves up a large chunk, and you need to compensate for that 